Alright guys, Ivan here, and this is Callum Bunmogger, his most recent photo upload, and uh, pretty much he's completely back. He's looking pretty much the same as he looked before. There is a slight asymmetry with his arms, and it's barely noticeable, but if you know that he had an injury with his bicep, you can notice it. You can see that one bicep is slightly smaller than the other. But aside from that, he's looking the way he looked before. His lats are small, but they were small before. It's not nothing different, pretty much. I don't know about his legs, though. This is also a very recent photo of him. He looks full, he looks big, he looks shredded. He's really back. Yeah, this is it completely. I don't know about that hair, though. <laughs> I don't really like it. It seems a little bit odd, but who cares about that? Um, his legs, I you can notice that the right leg is looking a little bit smaller. I think that's the one where he had got that horrible injury. And this is him before, in his heydays. So, the only thing that maybe is a little bit different now is the, the asymmetry in his arms and especially in his legs. Uh, the bicep tear wasn't that serious, but that knee uh, injury was a really bad one. So, I don't know how will he recover from that, but he's pretty much there, almost, uh, with his upper body. I don't know about his legs, he didn't show them exactly. But as far as his upper body, he's pretty much the same as he was before. And I was not expecting him to come back completely. I expected that he's gonna pretty much give up on bodybuilding. That's how it seemed. That's how it seemed, but apparently he's back. And this is a huge difference. This is how he was like a few months after the injury. So he was much smaller, much smaller. And uh, yeah, now he's back. Now he's much bigger. And what do I think? Do I think he will actually come back to the competition world? Will he start competing as a bodybuilder again? I don't know about that. Probably not. He's probably not gonna compete again because I don't think he can completely recover from those injuries and be at his 100%. But if he really has a desire, he can probably work around it. But I don't think really that he has that fire inside of him anymore. But we'll see what happens. Anyways, he's training hard. He's probably trying to get his size back because I, maybe he tried to be a little under muscle for some time and apparently he didn't like it. Bodybuilding is in his blood. He will probably always train and always, you know, live like a bodybuilder, like an athlete, because that's what he is. That's how he became popular and famous, and uh, I don't think he can run away from that, at least not for a long time, until he's young. Maybe when he gets older, maybe he decides to give up on it, but right now it seems like he's gonna keep training hard and uh, getting his mass back. Anyways, there is another story. There is a, a Luke Sando physique update, so he posted this nine hours ago. And uh, nothing new, really, here. He seems on track if he is preparing for the Mr. Olympia, but I'm not exactly sure if he is even qualified for it. He did not win any shows. He took third at the Arnold Classic, which carries a lot of points, and he placed highly on some other competitions, but I don't know if that's going to be enough. I'm not sure. Maybe he's not even sure. And this does not look ready for British Grand Prix, which is happening in like 10 days. So he will probably do some other show in between. There is still Chicago Pro, I don't know exactly when. There is also Tampa Pro. So I don't know what his plans are. Maybe he is qualified for the Mr. Olympia based on points. Maybe, I'm not sure. If you guys know exactly what are his plans and uh, is he qualified with the points, tell me in the comment section below. Anyways, he's training very hard, very, very hard at this point. Uh, considering how how close to the competition he is and considering the fact that he is dieting he's still lifting some heavy ass weights so this is it for this update video guys thank you for watching if you enjoyed the video make sure to like it and if you want to see more subscribe all the best guys bye bye